get me. No, 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 no. Inside, inside. I'm caught in the web. There's a lava down here. Oh, 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 oh there's so many. Oh, man. Fucking die. Oh, my health. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God, they're gonna break down the door. They're gonna kill everyone in the village. Die, 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 die. No, no, no. The Nether. Why are we here? Nether Quartz. Why do we need Nether Quartz? I don't know. We, we just do, okay? Your boy be looking fine. Now the Nether Quartz is for a observer. So we can get some automated redstone going. Big brain moves, my friends. Big brain moves. We got super lucky with our Nether Pool. And guess what this is? That's not the fucking place. Just gonna take care of this yellow son of a bitch. Anyway, as I was saying, that is a nether fortress. Can you believe it? My god, I'm under attack. Goddamn sands. Sir, I'm trying to narrate here. And now he's not attacking me. Make up your mind. <laughs> I mean, come on. What the fuck? That's it. You're going in the ground. And your brother, too. Nope. Nope. Stop. That song is copyrighted. Nope. Trying to get my video claimed. And you! Stop it. I actually quite like quartz as a building material, so I decided to collect a little more than I needed. Plus XP. Actually, I think this is quite a good source of XP. So are creepers. <laughs> kind of nuts that we found a fortress at the spawn. I was hoping that we could, uh... Make some potions and stuff. So, finding this it was good, you know? Pretty happy. But the zombies were just relentless, man. Dropping down. You damn spider zombies. Where is he? Th there he is. It's time for death. There you go. So, what do we have inside? Blazers and withers. Okay. I mean, it's good because sometimes you can get empty nether fortresses. So, danger is actually good in this sense. Entrance is over on this side, right by the portal. That's probably how we'll get in. But not, but not now. <laughs> we'll have to wait, wait until we got a, a couple more pieces of gear before that. I decided to have a look around before I went inside and uh, found this guy. Oh, he's gonna get me. No, 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 inside, inside. I'm caught in the web. Ah! No, 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 uh, close the door, okay. Uh, strategies. Pro gamer. Outplayed nerd. How could you possibly win against this man? Says, I'm gonna politely ask you to get off my property. Nope, nope, stop trying to eat my brains. You'll starve. Anyway, sleeping time. Day 28, we did some farming. Then we fed the mobile steak supply, collected some of these tall boys here, and then got thinking about how we're gonna build this observer thing. I'll be honest, I'm not the best when it comes to these kind of things, as we'll soon see. Just as I was about to get started, we heard this sound. Now what that sound is, is one of these little tree guys. You remember that from the last episode? And they spawn other parasites, so I'm pretty keen to not have them around my base. I had a quick look around, but couldn't see him, so... God damn it. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. And... place! Nope. Place. Nope, place, 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 there, there we go. 10% of the time, it works 100% of the time. Science. Day 29, I'm still trying to figure out how to do the automated redstone. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not very good at redstone, as you can probably tell. Very striking. 
when you sit as close as this to see how similar they are to human beings. You know, it just occurred to me, if, if I grow like literally one thing of sugar cane, it will still take forever to get like any significant amount. So we're going with two. And there we've just doubled our output, boys. We are engineers. Here we go. And it works. Uh, no, it doesn't. Why am I so bad at this? It seems like some went down the hopper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Day 30. Harvest the grass. Feed the cows. And then continue the harvest of the pyramid. You know, I took care of the pyramid. <laughs> It's rightfully mine. I could build a base inside of it, but instead I will build a base from it. Yeah, that makes sense. Anyway, the current plan is to replace as much of this disgusting dried sand with sandstone as possible, including on my little machine here, which is probably making redstone engineers think bad thoughts. We decided to build some more stuff on the house because bigger is indeed better. I also really need to cover up this wiring from my redstone because it, it looks awful and exposed wiring is always a good thing. thinking a balcony up here. Could be an idea. I don't know. My building is always... Anyway, let's see what enchants we got. Efficiency 1. Efficiency 1. And efficiency 1. Wow. The choices. Man. <laughs> it's, a it's a tough one. Alrighty, let's just close this off. Pretend it never happened. Nice. Next, we replace this entire floor with sandstone. Getting real creative with my building materials, aren't I? Eh, I think it looks good. Be gone. What do we think? Yeah? Nah? Yeah? Yeah, nah? Our next goal is making an anvil so we can do some repairs on our tools. But holy balls! How, mi how, how much iron? All of it? Okay, fine. In the morning we fed the cows, built a new line for the sugar cane, and then started digging for diamonds. What did we find? Did we find some? No. Here's a pro gamer tip. Always fill the holes you make. That way, goblins and ghouls can't sneak up on you and take what isn't theirs. You know what isn't mine? Diamonds. Or even gravel for that matter. Feed cows. Feed. Oh, I take it back. Yay. I kept looking for diamonds, but we ran into a problem. I only like going north. I don't really like going left or right. And to the north, it's just loads of spaghetti. But then I came up with a genius plan. I made a little depository, and then gradually just grabbed it and put it down there. There's a lava down here. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay, apple time, apple time. Here we go. Uh, now I'm just burning and healing. I decided to continue, but this time, carefully. On the next day, we gathered our sugar cane, and then I tried to make a golden apple, but I, I didn't have enough gold. So we went back to the mine, this time with a bucket of water. Oh yeah, it's satisfying. Then we found some gold, so golden apples are on the menu once again. After getting up from the mine, I had another idea for another automated machine. This one hopefully better than, than the last. The machine is going to be an automated forger. But I don't know how to make it. Hang on, I'll be right back. I placed the forge in the wrong place. There we go. And now we need chests and hoppers, I think. No, not these kind of hoppers, but we do need wood. <laughs> 
I'm going to go back inside now. Ho ho ho, a new challenger approaches. You are ugly, sir. I wish you death. There you go. Disgusting. So, what do we think of my automatic forger? Basically, you put the stuff in there, gets cooked up nice and good, and comes out here. Nice. Then I murdered a bunch of plants because I didn't like it. Oh my god, no. Uh, I am so sorry, doggo. I decided to place all this dirt down to see if we could get some natural trees growing because we're hurting for wood. Doc is just sitting in the, in the ground. Plant one tree here and one here. Call me Mr. Beast too. Cows! This episode I've really tried to show you just how terrible I am at redstone. Okay, so the bone meal makes the tree grow. But, if you put the bone meal in the dispenser, it does not. Fucking why? It says on the Minecraft wiki it should work. Maybe it needs to be repeating. There we go. No, it, I got it working. Do not ask me how long it took. But still no worky. I feel like this stuff is meant for greater minds. Let's try it with a crop. And it works with a crop. I... I just... Eh? You are in the wrong pen. I'm afraid that means... Anyway, so we're gonna go sell this paper because emeralds and then maybe even enchanted book Who knows? So we headed out and had a, a hearty breakfast of Delicious delicious carrots just in case you're wondering by the way watch the first episode We found this village and we found this guy who buys paper at a price I'm gonna name him Mr. Paper person Or Mr. PB Comedy! On the way back to the village though, I found this house. So I decided to have a look inside, just in case there were any goodies. I was a little scared of parasites though, but it was fine. We didn't find much. Some enchanted leather stuff and uh, a couple of books. Disgusting. Books are good though. I need them for my enchanting table. Oh god, now he's back. Dude, stop it! You'll get the video claimed! Jesus. Hello. Would you like to be my friend too? I've got a bone. Okay, maybe a berry. Ah, Jesus! Fuck it up! Ah! Oh, my heart! Ah, oh, it hurts! Ah! Uh, it came out of nowhere. Jesus. We made it just before nightfall. But I did forget to bring a bed, so we're gonna have to find somewhere to sleep. Hello. Are you still buying paper? Hey, it's better price than it was last time. So we just drag that here, grab an emerald, drag that there. Respiration? Do I look like a fisherman to you? I'll have you know the only thing I fish for is likes or subscribers. I thought these guys looked pretty cozy inside the house. I'm sure they wouldn't mind another visitor. So I let myself in and prepared to sit out the night. There was one thing I hadn't considered. It's been a long time since I haven't slept the night. And I... I had forgotten exactly how dangerous nights can be. But when the mobs started to spawn, I realized the mistake that I've made. Oh god, they're gonna break down the door. They're gonna kill everyone in the village. And then they're going to eat me! Oh my
never expose the need. Oh god, no. No, 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 no. Oh, I didn't think about this. It's all that flying guy's fault. If it wasn't for him, I could have left and killed the zombies with my sword. Uh, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him. Die, 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 die. No, no, no. So he's right on top of me. But I have an idea. We'll dig through this. He should be. Yeah. How about these, sir? Uh, you killed my friend. That's what you get. Well, we survived the night. I'll take the books as my reward. Knowledge. Do you have anything good? Huh? No. Don't you realize that I saved you? I mean, I caused it, but... Did it, Patrick! We saved the city! Just think what might have happened if we didn't tell everyone about them! Iridocyclitis. Fine, I'll just take some more emeralds. And good day, sir! I said good day, sir. And so I headed home. Albeit quite a lot sadder than when I arrived. The next day, we took care of a zombie. Doggo would have wanted us to continue. So now, we're doing it for him. And hey, maybe we'll find another companion. But not right now. Right now, we'll do some building. Day 39, I wanted to see if I could make a new friend, but he wasn't interested in chicken drumsticks. You aren't supposed to be here. And you're supposed to be in your pen. Damn cows, so stupid. What? Get off my property! That damn gong sound again. I swear there's someone trolling me at this point. The reason we're dropping trees is we want to finish off the enchanting table. And uh, I kind of messed up the configuration before. So we need more oak for the bookcases. And there we go. 
Do we have more than just efficiency this time? Yeah. We spend the rest of the day in the mine, trying to avoid more hot spaghetti. Don't want to end up deep fried like last time. Now we managed to find some more diamonds. Woohoo! This farm is annoying me though. Disgusting. It needs to be automated. So we raise the earth and then set about building a automated well slash farm thing. Water in here and then it kind of clears the crops for you. I'll show you how it works. You see, so the water comes down and then it clears all the crops. Knock these out of the way. And uh, so I'll clear up this space as well and plant crops down here. And uh, I just destroyed all my wiring. Why am I so stupid? You know, around about this part in the video in episode one, I did a little musical montage. So let's do that again. On day 46, we were under attack by this little square. I hate you, little square. I spent literally an hour going through every option available before finding I pressed K. My brain don't work good. Anyway, so we're still trying to get the flame enchantment so we can roast up those parasites nice and good. Oh, and we enchanted the pickaxe and shovel. So look at this. Ooh, ooh, nice. And shovel. Mmm. Nice. Decided to start rearing some chickens. Just as an alternate food supply. I don't know if it's living in the desert, but the crops take ages to grow. But on day 48, I made myself a helmet and some trousers. Ooh, yeah, look at this boy. I also had a look at what kind of mod weapons are available. And I like the look of this. So, we have an opening available for you. You could be my friend. Or not. It's fine. So we took care of some zombies. Flip, flip, flip. Flip, flip, flip. And then, on day 49, we had a problem. What the hell is that noise? Oh my god, no. So the second I woke up that day, a creature had climbed the fence and gotten into the cow pen and began transforming every single one of the cows. By the time I noticed what the noise was, every cow was infected and there was nothing I could do except get rid of them before they mutate. But, as an added bonus, when you kill them, they drop these little leech things. And, well, you can see what happened next. Last one. Okay. Oh, there's a little oh, and another one. Okay. No, 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 no. Die. They're fast, but they're not strong. Uh -oh. I think very soon we're gonna have a big problem on our hands. I'm thinking range is gonna be the smart idea here. Have at you, sir. Yeah. Oh lord, he coming. I'm gonna pull the old get in the doorway trick. <laughs> I played nerd. Yeah! Yeah! Bravery is for noobs. However, I still gotta take care of these bloody guys. Oh, there's a lot of them now. 
Why, hello, can I help you? I help Oh, Jesus! Ah, uh, I was gonna say I helped you with death. How are you, Norman? It's time to die. There we go. At least they aren't hurting the chickens. Nanny? A new challenger. One. Two. Two. <laughs> wouldn't die. Let's see if we can gingerly persuade a few more. Okay, that's, that's, that's enough. Enough, enough, enough. No, 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 no. Oh, my health. Oh, there's so many. Oh, man. Fucking die. Oh, my health. Oh, no, oh, no, no. Be God, evil tree. Okay, inside. Inside, inside. Don't go outdoors. There's nothing for you out there. Okay, that's enough being stupid for one day. I built this boat for a reason. Now I'm going to use it. All taken care of. Jesus, two and a half hearts. Not good. Not good. Honestly, I'm really glad that these chickens either can't get infected or just didn't. It means that I've got at least one food supply left. On day 50, we didn't do anything in the base. We just went exploring. I want to find myself a wolf companion, because you can get wolf armor in this game. I miss Doggo, but being by myself is just risky. There are too many times I've been snuck up on, but one thing's for sure, I will survive 100 days in the Parasite Apocalypse.